Hey there, people. Well, I got a message on Facebook today. And to think I used to hate Facebook. But anyway, I got a message from an old high school buddy of mine. He's got an apartment building and he's got some appliances for me. So we're on our way to pick that up right now and we'll see what he's got. Right on. So yeah, we did have snow on the ground this morning. It's all gone, but it's still snowing a little bit. I guess it's coming. Got no choice, we can't avoid it. Just gonna grab myself a coffee. It's pretty damn cold though. It's, the coffee's good just to warm up my hands. Really? Well, there we go. Big thank you to Chris. I will have a beer for you, buddy. Well, I gotta rearrange this. I might be picking up a motor. The motor that I was talking about two weeks ago. We'll see. No engine for me today. Like, the guy calls me the other day and says, uh, call me back. I don't have call display, so... <laughs> it's pretty hard to call back when I don't have his number. But I did get his number today, so I'll call him later on tonight and try to hook it up for tomorrow, so... That way I can have a full load to go back to the scrapyard. But anyway, I had seen a futon frame on close to my house, so I'll go grab that at least. Here's a little pet peeve of mine. Like, this guy's turning left, and he doesn't leave me enough room to turn right. Like, he could have gave me a couple inches. Just a pet peeve. I'll get through it. <laughs> I'm sure I will live. A little awkward, but what can you do? I do need a sawzall, like, one day, one day. Oops, let's get that in real quick. I'm glad nobody was behind me for that one, holy. I got her tied down now, so it's all good. Like, we're in the neighborhood where there's a million prostitutes, so there's cops everywhere, like, I'm, shh. I'm glad there was no cops around. Swing. Well, we made it home safe. Windy as heck out here, man. Well, my copper pile is getting bigger. I got lots in the garage. This might be a winter project. I'll start stripping. Quite a while back, somebody was asking me about a glass for a fireplace. Well, I picked one up today. I forget who was asking me about it, but anyway, I'll put it aside and uh, whoever it was, if you wanted to let me know, I'll put it aside for now. Okay, let's go in for a beer. I'm not sure why, but I'm sharing my supper breakfast with you. I don't know why. Big cheers to Chris. It was nice to see you after all these years. Right on, buddy. So hopefully picking up that motor works out tomorrow. Like, I got almost a full load with that little aluminum block in the back there. That'll add to the pile. I had a goal of trying to hit 666 videos by Halloween, but it's not going to happen. I'm at 650. So there's no way I can get 16 videos by Halloween. Anyway, people, appreciate you guys watching. Cheers. And we'll talk to you later. Well, since Gasoline's house is on the way home, let's go see what he's up to. If he's home. Almost missed it. There's his new truck. Look at that. She's pretty. Tires and all, eh? Fancy pants. Look at Buddy. Hi, Buddy. You always look so scared. There's no reason to be scared, Buddy. You're a good girl. You are a good girl. Go, Steph, go.
I'm not hearing much from the garage, but we'll go see if he's in there. Oh, I smell smoke. Hello? No, hello. Low job St. Jean. <laughs> That's a new one. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Look at you all smiley. How was your ride? Awesome. Good stuff. <sighs> yeah. Nice truck. Thanks. You jelly? No. Nope. My chef guy. <sighs> yeah, but it's a comment. She's beautiful though, I have to say. Yeah, she's got a little few rough spots, but uh, she's got some nice parts in her. You have a light right there. This? Not what do you need a light for? Like a light so I can see what the fuck I'm torching. Oh, a flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll get you a flashlight. Lambert, I want you to go on. Put that light down, basically. Put that light down, basically. I got a flashlight for you. Does it work? I don't know. We'll find out in a sec. Is it green? Yeah, it's Is blue, it bluish. Oh, the fuck? on my new workbench.